Hello everyone, uh, we are telling you hi from Changemakers on Workation clip at the studio from Surf Camp and uh, I'm Simona from Changemakers on and I'm very pleased to meet Monica D. I will tell like this, uh -huh. you, you can tell your surname yourself, it's too <laughs> difficult even for me being Lithuanian to pronounce it, <laughs> so imagine. So I'm telling hi Monica D from Ocean Design. Actually, it's a social entrepreneur, uh, impact entrepreneur, I would call like this, uh, creating a very nice brand. But first of all, tell yourself what you are doing. Hi, Simona. Thank you for the representation and introducing me. I'm Monika Drasdowskaita. <laughs> oh my God, I will <laughs> broke my tongue. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Um, I'm creating a fashion brand, a sustainable fashion brand, which is not only about the fashion. The, this is about the, you know, the philosophy, the deeper connection um, with the higher self as a woman and with the ocean, which is inside and outside. And I want to invite uh, all the women to, you know, to uh, find. Uh, the meaning of the inner ocean uh, which is about you know uh, to how to see to find the value uh, and to inspire not only uh, others but start from uh, yourself <laughs> yeah. it sounds like a fashion with a soul yeah fashion so. with a soul and fashion with a philosophy which sounds like um, uh, spontaneous, mysterious, wild and free, the ocean within me. So everything starts with, within us. When we have, you know, the deeper connection with our higher source and within, with ourselves first, then we can create and impact others by, you know, spreading the light and spreading the... Mm, it mm. sounds like you should, like, create the community behind yeah. as well it's not only just about the brand it's about the yeah. community which is proud to carry it yeah but you know i want to go a little bit deeper into the eco innovation part okay <laughs> uh, and uh, because uh, there are a lot of if we take a look to, to the markets right there are a lot of uh, already uh, brands which are uh, trying to narrow down a little bit that consumption to decrease the consumption right mm -hmm. And uh, but where is your innovation? Is it something about? I see that you brought a lot of materials yeah. here, <laughs> so maybe uh, you can tell a little bit more about the differences that you have behind your uh, okay. your brand. Yeah. Uh, so ocean design is about uh, an innovations, as you mentioned, and the innovations begin where, you know, the technology start and um, the first thing I wanted to tell you is about the, the fabric itself because all the fabrics I've chosen to work with and to create from are from innovative and um, you know ecological perspective they are made so starting from the you know the uh, the materials, the fabrics. Uh, the one I've chosen is the Econil regenerated nylon. It's made of the you know the the waste. Uh, it you know that all the waste is collected from the oceans, and mm -hmm. from the pre and uh, post consumer waste. So they are made into the regenerated nylon, and it's endless possibilities. Every time you can remake it. So uh, yeah, so this is one like it's here you can touch it. Okay. Yeah, it's waterproof and windproof. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Good. Okay. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Yeah. And um, the second I've chosen is the cactus leather, but I have some issues uh, concerning the logistics because it's from Mexico, and um, uh, the cactus is made and grown naturally with no pesticides, organically. The uh, the leaves are cut and they are made into you know the leather mixed with cotton or polyester. It depends or just 100% cactus. Yeah, yeah in, in Europe it's quite a challenge to have this yes. innovation, let's say production of yes. this uh, textile like in, uh, in Lithuania or somewhere else because uh, we do not <laughs> grow so many cactus, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, but so why it's okay? Because we have a lot of cactuses growing in that part of the world, yeah, right? Yeah, and, and, and the cactus in is south, uh, in south and like uh, South America and all of Brazil and other countries. Mm -hmm. And they uh, have the, you know, the the power to um, absorb.
absorb the CO2. CO2. So uh, okay. they, you know, they lower the the impact uh, of 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 the CO2. CO2. But do you mean that if, for example, I wear my jacket, yeah. uh, which is produced uh, from cactus yeah. leather, yeah. in this case, while wearing it, I am already Absor you mean absorbing the CO2? Um, it's no, like this? No, it's not like this. Okay, no. because I thought, only oh my god, I want no. everything from no, there. No, 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 no. <laughs> only when they are, you know, growing, only, okay, when, only when they are growing, mm -hmm. they are just, you know, uh, circulating the um, the atmosphere, the okay. environment. Clear. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. So only after they are making, remaking, so they are cleaning and they are preparing for wearing for the skin and for the human being. And only matured uh, cactus ca could could be cut. It. It's like you know, women cut yeah, the haircut. Yeah, yeah. Make the haircut, so it's the same. Nobody is and nothing is hurt and damaged. So it's natural procedures. Processes. Okay. So from what I heard, that means and even if you ha have allergies for some yeah. uh, for some materials, so this is totally non-allergenic, right? Yeah, absolutely. And because I have. Very clean, yeah, and yeah, cetera, et cetera. yeah, okay. yeah, exactly. And I have two more options uh, as a fabric, w uh, who which are super uh, for uh, suitable for people who have like kind of um, skin allergies, dermatitis, uh, psoriasis, um, uh, fibromyalgia. So uh, one of them is 100% organic, which is grown in Turkey and Brazil, and it's made with no totally no pesticides it's um, grown in between five food supplements uh, and including the uh, organic cotton and made absolutely natural with no additional uh, water resources only rainwater is used and uh, it's super good for people who have yeah, such you need kind to of communicate problems. about that because yeah. actually this is the biggest part of the education which is missing let's say right because yeah. when you see a jumper hoodie let's say you see hoodie yeah. ocean design okay I, li I love ocean hoodies as a hoodie <laughs> i buy it qualitative okay it's qualitative <laughs> but this is the real case is why this is Exactly, this hoodie, yeah. let's say, right? Yeah. Okay, but I see one more, which <laughs> yeah. is my level. Yeah, it's, you know, <laughs> I know it for years <laughs> already. It's and a finally kind of dessert. It in, yeah, so uh, it's a 100% um, orange fiber silk. And uh, it's made of 100% orange peels uh, from cellulose. And uh, what I like most about the fabric is uh, it's, um, you know, has... Uh, mm, vitamins and um, essential, essential oils. oils, right? Yeah, I forgot the word. <laughs> so I was yeah. still <laughs> used to from essential oils, oils because yeah. this is why I love yeah. it. Yeah. yeah, and it's kind of luxury uh, fabric because you know it's moisturizing all the time your skin, so the skin um, has the possibility to take it for everything what is best from the fabric, and uh, it continues up to 20 washes. So until you uh, do not finish your limit until 20 washes, so you can enjoy the spa for your skin. Yeah, yeah I love <laughs> it. And actually, the story itself, how uh, it was founded yeah. itself, uh, it's very interesting for the next time, <laughs> uh, for not to tell everything okay. at once. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but it's uh, really, I love it. Okay, mm -hmm. so one is materials, uh, and another thing, uh, why you are different, or where is your innovation, let's say? Continuing this uh, innovation topic, I wanted to mention why we are different, is that we make transformable clothes. Uh, for example, we created a um, transformable puffer coat, which could... Okay, if you want to see how does it look like, go to Facebook. Ocean Design, Instagram, Ocean Follow, <laughs> Instagram, sorry, yeah. Ocean Design, Official. Follow, <laughs> and uh, you will get all <laughs> the information. pictures <laughs> and information. <laughs> yeah, good introduction. <laughs> um, yeah, so uh, 
that's why we are different because we create uh, fashion, create clothes for women who is always active, who is always on, you know, the the things that want to try to do and to experience. So that's why I'm trying to um, find the solutions for women who want to, you know, take everything from uh, life and uh, to transform the cloth uh, depending on the situation where she is. Okay, that sounds really nice and <laughs> slow fashion and trans, uh, transformable yeah. and all those eco materials you use and uh, if I correct understand you are always looking right for a new materials Actually, yes. which could be <laughs> very eco, very clean, uh, very friendly for uh, environment, uh, people and animals as well, yeah. right? Yeah. So it sounds it sounds really interesting. Oh, thank you. And actually, yes, I am keen on th those innovations and some of uh, examples of new fabrics, uh, swatches. They're coming from India this week or next week, uh, like uh, lotus silk or roses silk or banana fabrics. So okay, <laughs> shout out to all startups <laughs> which are producing. Mm -hmm unseen <laughs> before materials from wherever it would be. Uh, call Monica <laughs> D, connect with her, and propose to try. <laughs> yes, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, so actually, thanks a lot. I could discuss with you very deeply uh, and go very deeply into those topics, but just wanted very brief uh, understanding and to show a little bit uh, to our people, to the society, and to everyone, uh, for not to go just to shops, but to uh, look what is coming on the stage. Yeah. Because every day, new and new startups born. Yeah. Right? Right, exactly. I Thank hope you to see Simone. you next time as well. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye.